Hello YouTubers, Merry Christmas and welcome to Day 2 of the 12 Days of Christmas Cars Diecasts. Today, we're going to take a look at Double Clutch Dally, the, the former Piston Cup Flag Waver, now Cotter Pin Waiter from Cars 3. Before we get right into the review and the retrospective, let's start with the unboxing first. Here we've got his artwork and his die cast sealed in and his name saying Double Clutch Dally and with it is Doc Hudson in his racing attire and his dirt track variants with the red rims and black wall tires and it says Dirt Track Fabulous Hudson Hornet the, old, the Cars logo, new 2021 in a desert background, the metal logo. And on the back we have the Cars 3 logo and the Los Angeles International Speedway background. And we have Speedy Comet and Parker Brakeston, Ryan Inside Laney and Eric Breaker, Jackson Storm, and Laura Spinwell, who I unfortunately don't have. Heyday Junior Moon, who I on Heyday Junior Moon and and Leroy Hemming, who I unfortunately don't have either of the two, and Hit and Run, who I also unfortunately don't have either of the two. The Arsene logo. 2020 Mattel, made in Thailand, Disney slash Pixar, Ford, Chrysler, Hudson Hornet, which three of those are copyrighted, WWW dot disney dot com slash cars made in thailand and now without any further ado let's get right into the unboxing so here we have double clutch dally all opened up and out of the package as well as the dirt track fabulous hudson hornet but I'm going to have to discard him for, and, and that's a review for Dirt Track Fabulous Hudson Horn in another day. Anyhow, <clears throat> Double Clutch Dally is a pity who used to work as a flag waver for the Piston Cup in the 1950s. He then retired and is now a waiter at the Cotterpin Bar and Grill in Thomasville. During his appearance in Cars 3, he was first seen in a achieved recording of Doc Hudson's crash on the Fireball Beach course during the 1954 Piston Cup season. His second appearance in the film was, as, was he was seen as a waiter when Smokey, Lightning McQueen, Cruz Ramirez, Luigi, and Guido had entered. He'd, he then appeared in, during Smokey's flashback as a flag waver when Doc outsmarted Leroy Hemming, who I unfortunately don't have. And during his diecast releases, he was released only one time in a two-pack with Dirt Track Fabulous Hudson Hornet. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So here we've got his checkered flag, which he is holding, and his mouth is invisible, and his light dark blue paintwork and his his white eyelids and the blue his blue hat and his gray arms and the the white rims on the black wall tires and the black cylinder thing whatever it is tell me what it is in the comments down below 
and on the under and on the undercarriage it says Disney slash Pixar made in Thailand. And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other Thomasville inhabitants. We have Smokey, Junior Moon, Louise Nash, Xanadu Bumpers, Sweet Tea, and some of the other pities. We have Lug and Nutty. Sarah Coggs, Circus Pity, Millie, the Zen Master Pity, and Guido. And that is it. So, what do you guys think? Which Thomasville inhabitant is your favorite? And which Pity is your favorite also. Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below or on the voting poll or in the community tab or either way. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And also don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for day three tomorrow, so please stay tuned. Merry Christmas. Goodbye now.